thing. I'm just so afraid that they're gonna break into that wall and find, I don't even know what. Yay, just to look and see. Welcome back to the vlog. The office is a mess. Don't mind it. This week, we're doing some renovations in the house. It's not like a fun little renovation that was planned. This was something that needed to happen. Let me take you to my bathroom and show you what's going on. But before we even go there, I have to say that I'm kind of embarrassed. Like, just don't judge me too hard, okay? So when we first bought the house, everything was renovated except this one bathroom. So this was coming. But anyways, let me just show you. This is what my bathroom looks like right now. Oh my God, it's seriously so embarrassing. Okay, and the reason why we're doing renovation is uh, this right here like there's mold in there and it's gross and it needs to go and so obviously that's not where the troubles end with this bathroom they just like painted over this gross looking tile so it's all chipping this is a super old bathtub like everything is chipping the um what's it called the faucet and stuff is like super beyond old this is terrible even the um texture on the wall is like super old school they literally just like smack some paint on top of it don't mind my swimsuit <laughs> they literally just put some paint um so that it would be like sellable with the rest of the house um these fixtures are terrible the tile is terrible everything is terrible this bathtub is old and look at this floor yuck it's just beyond not great not great anywhere like nothing i hate it hate it all all right seriously i hope you're not judging me too harshly so the whole bathroom is being taken down to the studs tomorrow morning we have another bathroom in the house so i'll be using that but not just not ideal and the whole thing is going to take like two and a half weeks Today we're starting construction in the house. I'm a little nervous. I don't know what to expect. I just hope everything goes okay. But, oh my gosh. I'm just so afraid that they're gonna break into that wall and find, I don't even know what. We do not need any budget increases or any nonsense. Like, I just hope it all goes to plan. I need to like clear all of my shampoos and all this stuff take all of the little things out of this bathroom because they're getting here at 10 and they're just like getting to work so this is gonna get reused so this should not be in this box God, i feel like i don't even use half this stuff All right, that's it. We're empty. Ooh, there's an echo in here now. And ready for them. We're good. All right, let me show you the fun part. The vibe we're going for once this is all over. This is the vibe we're going for. We're going with the cottage, modern farmhouse situation. Uh, a lot of this stuff is from Target, some is not. I will link to whatever I can find in the description below, but um, hello there. Um, so this is the tile we're going with, just a plain subway tile, and then I'm going to paint the vanity this color this weekend. That will be interesting. And then we're going with, um, matte black finishes. So these are the curtain rings, and then, um, the contractor is bringing the faucets and all of that stuff, which are in the shower, which are all going to be matte black to match. I think the lighting fixture is arriving in the mail today and that's matte black and with a little bit of gold. Repurpose, this already was in the was in the bathroom. This is gonna be for like cotton balls and that kind of stuff. Um I honestly don't remember where I got this from. I'm vlogging from my bedroom because this is the room that I'm confined to for the foreseeable future. You hear that noise in the background? We're in the... This is... This is life. 
think it's safe to say that Junji and Duvar are not handling this whole renovation business very well. Duvies, I'm so sorry. And Junji, oh, there he is. I'm sorry, you guys. I don't like the noise either, babes. It's okay. It's gonna be okay, though. I put this little blanket over here to make it a little better for them. Oh, I'm so sorry, babes. Alright, day two. I'll explain this in a minute. This is what we are dealing with. We are down to the So they've taken down pretty much everything. We're down to the studs. They just took out the bathtub. I'm gonna show you through the window because I don't want to be weird and they're gonna be like, why is she filming us? So hold on. So that's the bathtub they just took out. I don't know if it's if it's steel or not. They were saying that it might be, but I don't think it is. Basically, it's just been like a lot of banging, a lot of, apparently we have a very sturdy house, which is good to know for the next hurricane season. <laughs> the humming like that you hear in the background is that big machine that's out there. So that's supposed to like keep the room um, I don't know, it's part of the mold removal process, so it just needs to keep running for 48 hours. I thought, so in here right now, it annoys me because it's background noise and it's very distracting. And I thought in the middle of the night it was going to be terrible and it was going to keep me up all night. This thing acted kind of like a white noise machine. I slept better last night than I have in such a long time. That's where we stand on day two. Only like 20 more days to go. Good morning everyone. Today is day 9 or 10 of construction. This week was pretty quiet so they finished removing the mold uh, before last weekend and then they just left that noisy machine going uh, for days. And I just got the results yesterday saying yes, there's no more mold in the bathroom. Yay! So now we can begin construction. They said in four days they can get it done. A nice little twist that has been added to this is, my, is that my best friend is coming into town. Tara's coming into town uh, this weekend and she's gonna stay here. So I was like, we need to have this bathroom done before then. So they promised me they'll be done a day early. So today they're going to start with the construction. So yesterday uh, they came in and they dropped off all the fixtures, all the pieces pretty much of the puzzle. So let me show you. We have the tub over here in the dining room, along with the vanity. Over here we have the flooring. Oh, and then over here we have the fan. This I had to order a new one um, on Amazon because this is not quite the right color. Um, and then over here we have the shower and the sink. And then tiles over here. So this is where we stand with the construction right now. They put in the tub and this is after one day of work. So uh, what I told you was that like the drain of the tub wasn't quite the same color as everything else. And so I told them that I ordered some off of Amazon and it's going to arrive today. Um, and I don't think they love that too much to be honest. They're like it looks the same and I'm like mm. Not exactly the same like I feel like if I'm redoing the whole freaking bathroom and it's not something that I could have like done it myself so I'm like better to do it right the first time so those pieces should arrive by tonight and then they can finish the tub install and then uh, but I don't know why they just didn't start on everything else I mean what do I know I don't know anything about construction so but they have today tomorrow Thursday and Friday. They have four days to finish this. I'm getting a little anxious to be honest, but there's nothing I can do. So I will hold off another day before I start getting nervous, nervous. Someone is trust and that person is me. Oh my God, it is Wednesday. Yesterday, nobody came here to do anything. 
they showed up at like 9 a.m. and I was like, are we gonna get this done by Friday? And they, uh, and they were like, ooh, I don't know. I'm like, they were working all day. It's like six-ish. Uh, but anyways, let's look and see what we're dealing with here. Okay. All right. Well, that's something, I suppose. Okay, well, we have walls. So we have walls, which is what they were working on all day. The tub is fully installed. Um, got walls on this side, okay. And I noticed that they did put one little piece of flooring here. I think they were starting to figure out what that was going to look like. But that's it. Should I be worried? I'm thinking yes. So this is what the bathroom looks like right now. I, <laughs> I want to cry. Like we're not even close to being done. We have floors though. So that's good. But like, there is no chance, and they haven't removed the texture from the ceiling yet, so... <sighs> there is absolutely no chance that this bathroom is gonna be done. Not today, not tomorrow. There's nothing I can do about it. Let's see. Ooh, okay. We got tile all the way to the ceiling. We got, oh, we got window sill. I think we can, yeah, we can step in. So we got nice. window sill now. So it's coming together. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Wow. Coming together. I wanted no texture at all, but apparently it costs more money because then they have to get like they have to go for the effort of making it super smooth but it's smooth. already bumpy yeah it's naturally bumpy so putting the texture kind of masks that so it's going to cost more money to make it smooth so i was like okay make it the least amount of visible texture right like i had there were like literally 30 options of white paint and i just picked one and then your Vanity is painted green. is green, okay. and then the finishes are all going to be black, and yeah. the flooring is new. Yeah, I wanted it to be gr like darker gray, but this is what we had. So <gasps> this is not for you, no, ma'am. Yeah. <laughs> In the world is happening. I have no idea what's happening inside my house, but it is so loud. Today's supposed to be the last day though. I've been told that a few times. But I've given up. I'm just like, you know what? What will be will be. At some point I will have a bathroom. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, today is the day we are finishing this bathroom. Today! This is so exciting. I look like a mess. You will know why in if you watch the other vlog about uh, how the frozen croissants came about. So I'll put the link to that in the description below so that you know why I look like a mess today. But um, we're almost there. We're so close. Okay. Are you guys ready to see the final thing? Now, a couple of disclaimers here. If you've been following the vlogs, you know that the mirror that I got turned out to be too big. And it's been a journey to try to find a new one because it needed to be narrow and it was a nightmare to find it. But I did find it, so let me show you. And I found it on Facebook Marketplace. Shout out to Taylor for sending me numerous, numerous links. Finally found one that was the right size and the right style, but I have to paint the frame because this is not a vibe. But I think when we paint it gold, and I said I wasn't going to do any more DIY projects, but this should be easy enough, then it's going to be exactly what I want it to be. So that still has to go on the wall. Other than that, are you ready to see it?
All right, so let me explain what's going on over here. So I initially got this caddy over here for the bathtub, like the bathroom. I was gonna put it here in the corner, right behind where you are right now. But the height didn't really work. And when I was setting up the bathroom, I just kind of like placed it over here in the corner. And I was like, that actually kind of works. Is very practical. So over here, I have my nighttime routine stuff. Over here, I have my daytime routine stuff. At the bottom, I have like makeup wipes. Yeah, moisturizers and stuff over here. I told you over here, I put my cotton balls. Nice little candle. I love it. Came out just as I wanted. And then of course, over here with the blue tape, that's where the mirror is gonna go. And the people that did the whole renovation, they were so nice about it. <sighs> Looking back at it, I, you know, editing this video, I realized that like my expectations of how fast this is going to be were not really realistic. I'd never done a renovation before. I had no idea. And everybody told me like it always takes longer, but I was just like, no, it's going to go according to schedule because I need it to. It didn't. It was fine. But yeah, and they were so nice about it. And they were like, listen, when you find the mirror, give us a call and we'll stop by and put it up. So. I'm gonna give them a call uh, once I come back from Canada and I'm gonna tell them to put up the mirror and then another towel hook over here uh, for my face towel. So yeah, I think it turned out awesome. I will link to everything that I can in the description below. That's it for today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you guys here next week with a new one. Until then, stay curious.